Here's what's trending tonight. The talk of the town, or maybe I should actually say the talk of the state, is finding the best place in Arkansas to see the total solar eclipse. And if you haven't done this already, you need to mark your calendar because April 8th, it's going to be here before we know it, right? Got that right. Madison Gaffner spent the day in Hot Springs, which is right in the path of totality. <laughs> she has the details on how it's one of the trending places to view the big event. Hot Springs is expecting possibly the biggest day in tourism ever. And the excitement builds. Hot Springs is known for its tourism year round, but on April 8th, it won't just be visitors looking for a day at the spa on Bathhouse Row. Bill Solister with Visit Hot Springs says NASA will be in town too. NASA scientists will be coming to Hot Springs. Uh, they're, they're studying uh, animal behavior while they're here. They're actually doing uh, some uh, outreach um, where they're going to go around speaking to groups and talking about all things that you know NASA scientists talk about. And out at Garvin Woodland Gardens, instead of people looking Looking down at the beautiful flowers, they'll be looking up to the sky. The beauty uh, of Garvin Gardens really complements the beauty of Hot Springs in general. A great place to see it. With most campgrounds already sold out, hotels are still available. Hot Springs is expecting 100,000 people from Thursday before through Monday, the day of the big show. Some estimations, and based on um, you know where we're at, the fact that we're one of only two national parks in the country that's in the path of totality, that it's spring break season already, that it's race season. Solister offering a tip as a Hot Springs native. He says if he had to pick a place to be, it would be on a boat. Lake Hamilton right behind us, another beautiful place. I expect that we'll see a lot of boats on Lake Hamilton, Lake Catherine, and Lake Washita. And speaking of the day. Let's think about this. We won't have another uh, total eclipse in Arkansas for 21 years. So this, for most of us in Arkansas, is a once-in-a-lifetime experience.